there's a locked box, and the code is the secret number that only appears in remainders. Wait, we never see the number itself, just the remainders? That's right. The clues say our number leaves a remainder of 1 when divided by 4, 6, and 9. So, it has to fit all three clues at the same time. Exactly. Our mission is to discover that secret number hiding behind these remainders. We'll do it with a three-step decoder. First, combine two clues, then combine with a third, and finally pick the number you want. On the screen, these clues state, the number leaves a remainder of one when divided by four, six, and nine. Step one, let's ignore the nine for a moment and solve the clues for four and six together. So we're looking for numbers that leave a remainder of one when divided by both four and six? Exactly. Try numbers like 1, 13, 25. Each of these is one more than a multiple of both 4 and 6. These special numbers repeat every 12, which is the least common multiple of 4 and 6. So after we combine the first two clues, it's like we have a single clue. Remainder 1 when dividing by 12. Now, step 2. Combine that new clue of remainder 1 with 12 with the clue of remainder 1 with 9. On screen, first, the clue of remainder 1 with 4 and 6 becomes remainder 1 with 12. Then, combining 12 and 9 gives us a superclue, remainder 1 when divided by 36. The superclue says our number is always one more than a multiple of 36. So, it automatically leaves a remainder of 1 when divided by 4, 6, and 9? Exactly. Every solution looks like 1 plus 36 times some integer k. Now, imagine the puzzle says the code is between 30 and 40. Then 1 plus 36 k can only be 37, with k equal to 1. That's your three-step decoder. Combine two clues using a repeating pattern. Merge with the next, then choose the number in your range. Here, that method cracked the code. 1 plus 36 k gives 37 as the secret number in that box. Please like, share, and subscribe.